I was working on a lot of things. Um, my dad was pretty abusive um, to my mom and the three kids when you know, we were growing up, and he had all three of us. Uh, when my mom moved to Connecticut, that was sort of the choice. Either, you know, when they were getting the divorce, either you move to Connecticut and I get all the kids, he said, or you stay in California and we can share visitation and that she just wanted to get as far away as possible. And that was one of the major, major things that was like a turning point in my life. I was being resentful. I was like, you know, why did you leave us? You must have not loved us or all these things. And um, by the end of Radical Authenticity, I had, you know, gone out to dinner with her and she wanted to check in with me and see how the week was and see how I was doing with um, all the um, just program stuff, all the curriculum and everything. And I told her I just totally loved it and told her I had a question for her. And this was a question I had never asked once in my life. And it was, why did you leave? And I didn't want to know. I didn't ever want to know. And that was why I never asked. And... She looked at me, she looked at me when I asked, and she was like, I've been waiting 16 years for you to ask me that question. And it was like, oh, it was just so freeing. Um, I knew it was something about my dad, and I knew I wasn't going to want to hear it, because my dad was my best friend. You know, I grew up with him. I, I grew up resenting my mom for having left us and all these things. And after empowering yourself, I was just so realizing that, she was doing the best she could in the moment to take care of herself. She finally told me the reason why she left, and it was intense. It was hard for me to, I made it hard for myself to handle it first because it was directly, you know, about my dad and his abuse toward her, and I didn't want to hear it at first, but had I not taken empowering yourself and had I not taken radical authenticity, I don't know if I would have ever asked her. I think I would have still continued resenting and causing blame and just judging her and judging myself and judging everyone around me and it was so freeing and it was such an amazing eye-opener and uh, it was it was just great it was yummy <laughs>